Good morning, everybody. Hope you guys are having a beautiful day. So today is Wednesday. Tonight, today, Naraya has a physical. Um, she has to do an updated physical for uh, kindergarten. So I need to go do that today. I, I mean, I could have done it maybe like in June or whatever, but I just want to have everything so I, when she's in school there's no like setback to where it's like, oh she needs this ASAP or oh she can't start because she doesn't have this. So I just want everything while this school year is still on so that way next school year when she goes to kindergarten, um, there's no problem. So I'm just going to go do that today, but uh, first she has to go to school obviously. So. She uh, has her appointment right after school, so I'm going to pick her up like maybe 15 minutes before her appointment. So she's going to get 15 minutes early picked up out of school. Um, but I may go to Walmart, may bring you guys along. Um, I don't know if I'm going to put this vlog together with yesterday's vlog because I feel like yesterday's vlog was an epic fail. Good morning! Good morning! You're watching My Little Pony? Look at his fro though, like, I always wanted a kid that had curly hair that was like turned into a fro, and I got one. Um, my nephew was small like this, and he always had a little fro, and I would always run my hands through it, and I was like, I told my sister one time, I was like, I want a kid with a fro, and look, I got one. They have these bowls at Dollar Tree. I don't know if, do you guys remember these as kids? Like, I remember these as kids. 90s babies. These were like the shiz when we were kids. Um, and I got it for my kids because they always spill milk when they try to drink it out of the bowl. So, yeah, I like it. I like it. I love it. My car is nice and shiny because I washed it.
Ready for school? Let's go to school, girlfriend. Take me to school first and then you will go to Walmart. Mm-hmm. Okay. Ready, Teach? So right now we're on our way to go take Raya Yaya to school. So we're gonna take her to school and then we may go to Walmart, I'm not too sure. We're at Walmart. Oh. You ready to go shopping with mommy? Mama. 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 Can you believe at Walmart they have this big Tampico for a dollar ninety-eight? Yeah, sorry, my freaking, I don't know why my camera does that with the lighting inside the kitchen. It's only the kitchen. But look at this Tampico. You gonna be mommy's brave girl? You're gonna be okay, okay? I will. Raya passed her vision and her hearing. Good job, babe. Look at mommy. Good job. Don't be scared. Mommy's right here with you. So we just got back. Jackie came over and visited. I didn't um, vlog, but it was nice. I haven't seen her in a while. And my baby got shots. Let me see. She got one, two, and three. But you were so brave. No, I did not see that. One, two, and then three. Yeah, that's what I said. You got three. You were so brave, babe. So I'm gonna make some um, chile verde. I'm gonna do, um, not doing authentic. Sorry, y'all. You guys probably were like, oh, yay, maybe I'll get a recipe of like the like homemade sauce. But I'm doing this sauce. It's the Herdez. I'm not sure how you say that. Mexican cooking sauce the tomatillo verde so so i have the pork here's the pork it's already chopped up i got it at walmart for 5.53 and yeah so it's the pork just already chopped and then i'm going to be using this sauce like <clears throat> this is how it looks i'm not going to be making a homemade sauce using the tomatillos i'm not going to do that all that work because i just i feel really tired and i just want to use this sauce so i bought it at walmart and hopefully it's good if I'm going to taste it and then if I need to add any seasoning, I will. I'm going to use these refried beans and then I'm going to make a Mexican rice. So I'm going to do all that right now. So while I'm washing the dishes and cooking, the kids are right here playing. And I love my view. I love that I can see them. See, my sink is like literally right here. I got to wash dishes. And then I can see the kids right here. The best tip I can give you guys for making Mexican rice is when you do your one... I'm going to do one cup of rice. So this is just for a cup of rice. So I'm going to put one cup of rice in here. I'm going to brown it. I'm going to make it turn like an orange color till I add the water. But when I add the water, I'm going to add boiled water already. So I have three cups of water in here boiling. So I'm going to brown my one cup right now. So I'm going to put my one cup of rice in there. Brown it. After it's like already browned, go ahead and put the boiling water in there and then add in your bouillon. So for the rice, I use this um, caldo de tomate and I always use one tablespoon. If you use any more, it's gonna be really salty. So one tablespoon after you put the water in it. And this is how you want the rice to look uh, before you add the water. So it's real brown, as you guys can tell, it almost looks orange. So it's done, I'm gonna add in the boiled water. Woo! Add in one tablespoon of the chicken bouillon. And then season it with some onion powder because I forgot to add in an onion. So I'm gonna season it with some onion powder and then cover it, let it cook for 16 minutes on medium high, take it off of after 16 minutes and let it simmer for 10 minutes so it's gonna be cooking for 16 minutes while covered and then after you're done like I said take it off of the heat and put it on a different um, burner and then you can let it simmer for 10 minutes and it'll be done so before I browned the um, pork I seasoned it with salt and black pepper I just seasoned it all over and then I'm gonna brown it right now with oil so with the 
pork. I don't play with pork. I like to let it brown till like it looks like it's already cooking. Oops, it's a little. But yeah, I I like to make sure the pork is cooked. So I like to brown it. I like to season it with salt and pepper. And I always put an onion, but I don't have an onion right now. So I seasoned it with onion powder. And I'm just going to brown it on both sides to make sure like it's going to be cooked. But still, you're going to let it boil. So it's going to be cooking while it's like boiling and simmering. So you don't want to cook it too much where it's going to burn and get... Um, dried so I'm just browning it on each side. I'm probably doing five minutes each side not three so five minutes five minutes each side all right so now that it's browned I actually did six minutes each side so I would do like six to eight minutes so I did six minutes each side I browned and so now I'm gonna add one cup of water and let it uh, so simmered covered so you're gonna let it sit for simmer um, to heat reduce the heat that you have now let it simmer while it's covered for about 20 minutes. So now you're just letting it like cover the pot, let it simmer for 20 minutes with one cup of water. And you don't have, this part you would probably be making the sauce, but since I'm gonna be using this, you don't need to make it, so just let it simmer for about 20 minutes. So the rice is completely done. Um, it's so fluffy and like just real nice. And it's already been 10 minutes since it's been um, simmering, so it's all good. It's been 20 minutes now, so I'm going to go ahead and add the sauce in there and uh, bring up the heat and let it come to a boil. After it comes to a boil, I'm going to reduce the heat and simmer it for about 45 minutes. Okay, so I put the sauce in there, and then after I poured the sauce, there was like a lot on the rims of it so I went ahead and filled it up with water and I poured it all in there and now I'm going to season it with salt and pepper and then I'm going to bring up the heat which I already did and I'm going to mix it together and then cover it and bring it to a boil and after it's brought to a boil I'm going to stir it again bring it to a cover reduce the heat and simmer it for about 45 minutes while I'm um, mixing it still and it's all done so I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching subscribe and thumbs it up and I'll catch you guys in my next video bye everyone